Now, for installing this fake suppressor with an integral muzzle brake, you're gonna need to take out the existing muzzle device, and you're gonna have to find a way to secure your upper. I've chosen to use the Magpul VEV block, and that Magpul VEV block is gonna allow me to keep the barrel steady as I put torque on it while threading this guy. Now, this is a brand new barrel. This is a brand new muzzle device. This is the old crush washer. I could put the new one in there, but I don't feel like it. Let's see how it threads as it is without it. There it is. Don't want to cross thread that. Let's see how far they got along. Now, in terms of timing the break, it's just slightly off. So you do have to put a little bit more pressure in it to get it right where you want it. Now you could either heave on it and get nowhere, or what I found works really well for this type of brake is to stick something through the ports and use that for leverage. A four millimeter Allen key works really well for this. Now, that's timed, but it's kind of loose, so I'm going to keep going. That's it. Check to see how it looks. Use a little bit more. And there you go. That's how you install a brake.